All right, boys and girls, this is what we're going to do. We are going to paint our dinosaur. Um, I do not have the same colors for every table. That's just the way it goes. But what you want to do is pick a color that's lighter. Like I did um, on this one, I did light green and dark blue dots. This dinosaur, um, I started a dinosaur where I did light blue and I was going to do some stripes. This dinosaur, I'm going to do yellow. I just felt like I need to do a yellow one. So the first thing I'm going to do very carefully, and you'll notice that we're using a smaller brush, is we're going to paint the entire dinosaur our lighter color. All right, so I painted my whole dinosaur yellow. That's the first color. Now I wanna do the second color. So you wanna paint the bottom color lighter and then you're gonna come back with a darker color. I feel like I'm gonna do a dark green. So I'm gonna, and they're kind of, they're analogous colors. They're related to each other. They are next to each other on the color wheel. And as you well know, um, yellow and blue make green. I'm gonna start by painting my dinosaur's eyes green. And then I wanna think about, well, do I wanna do dots or stripes or something? And I think this time, I'm gonna do some stripes. Please don't mix the colors. Um, that would be great if you didn't. I know I'm asking for a lot, but. I'm gonna add some stripes. I feel like stripes would be a good thing for dinosaurs if they were trying to camouflage each other. Think about all the animals that have stripes, tigers, zebras. There's a lot of animals that have stripes and for different reasons. I try to keep the dinosaur in the video. Think about how the stripes are going to look on the dinosaur. The reason I say to do a light color first is it's way easier to paint over with a dark color than it is to try to lighten it up. There's his nose. Perhaps around his mouth gets painted. If you get some paint on your hands, that's okay, we'll wash it off. Maybe I'll put some dots around his head because it's kind of a weird area. And there we go. And there is my dinosaur and he is striped. Make sure you can read your name. If your name is hard to read, you can actually take the paintbrush and very carefully paint your name, especially with the dark color or initials. Make sure you put your class code. 5M, 3W, whatever, 3B. Make sure you close the container. If you have a little bit of paint on your hands, that's okay. Please do not paint your hands. Please do not paint your neighbor's hands. Don't paint your neighbors. Do not use water. Don't be careful as you're using the dinosaur, moving the dinosaur that you don't get hand, like some people will just grab it around here. I just went through that. Don't do that. Don't, don't do that. All right, I can't wait to see your dinosaur. Dinosaur.